Hey friends, I am Pastor Joe. Today is Monday and I have your word for the day. Have you ever run into somebody that constantly brags and boasts about their skills and their accomplishments? Is that something that you struggle with? Well, Proverbs 27.2 offers some great advice for those who boast. Solomon writes this, Let someone else praise you, not your own mouth, a stranger and not your own lips. When I was young and cutting my teeth in ministry while I was a youth pastor, I also owned and operated the website youthevangelist.com. Now the website only featured one speaker. It was yours truly. I know that God had called me to travel and share my childhood story and what God had rescued me from. So I created the website for other pastors to connect with me, hear my story, so they would invite me in to speak. On my first attempt uh, for building that website, and it ran for about a year, I had cut and pasted my face onto a flying superhero body, and that superhero body flew around the screen when people visited the website and read my story. It might surprise you, but I didn't get many requests to come in and speak. I learned a pretty humbling lesson. Uh, lesson. Let other people praise and recommend you. So I began to reach out to others to see if they would recommend me. And slowly but surely, I was able to build a good reputation as a youth evangelist. Uh, eventually, I was invited to be a speaker at the National Youth Workers Convention at Conclave Youth Ministry Training. I had my story shared on ABC Family through CBN. I shared my story at the largest gathering of teenagers in Georgia with over 6,000 teenagers. And I've been blessed to lead over 1,000 students and people to Jesus over the years. Why is that? Well, because early on, I had to learn that it is best to let others praise and endorse me. Because most people will proclaim their own goodness. But when somebody else praises and endorses you, it carries a whole lot more weight. So let me ask you a question. Is there somebody around you today that needs help or a recommendation? Would you give them a shout out and bless them today? It could be a local business owner, maybe an insurance agent, a real estate agent, or a local restaurant. Reach out, leave them a great endorsement, leave them a great recommendation. Let other people know how wonderful they are and why they can help meet their needs. You know, we need, as human beings, the encouragement of one another because we are truly all in this life together. So use your words today as a blessing and bless other people by endorsing and recommending them. If today's word for the day has blessed you, like it, share it, and leave a comment. God bless.